Kona is just basically a big, goofy, scaredy cat. But what's bad is she like antagonizes people in their own yards. Like if there's somebody in their own yard, two houses up, she feels the need to go antagonize them. It's so embarrassing. The coolest thing I read in one of my devotionals is that they said, God has planted blessings along your journey for the day. This is from Jesus Calling by Sarah. I forget the author. Anyway, the book is called Jesus Calling. Oh, I know Chloe, we're almost at the office. Anyway, it said Jesus has planted blessings along your path for today. You just have to look for them. And when you find a blessing, no matter how little, no matter how big, pluck it. And by the end of the day, you'll have a whole bouquet of blessings. Isn't that cool? I love you. I know it is cool. I love you. Are you wondering who I'm talking to? Yes. I got to trim Chloe's nails yesterday. She's actually really good about it. The vet taught me how when she was just a little tiny baby kitten. Remember when I was bottle feeding her? You just take a little pair of fingernail clippers and they seriously are so easy to, to do. They're much easier than dog nails because you know how the dog nails are really, really um, hard and it's, easy to, it's not easy to see the quick, which is the little blood part. And then when you clip it, it's painful and it bleeds a lot. One of my patients said she was clipping her dog nails, she never did it again because it bled so bad. She dunked the dog's paw into the flower because she didn't know what else to do. It's really... All right, we're here. Thank you for the chat. I hope you guys have a wonderful Friday and I'll see you guys tomorrow for our next Together Time.